After I dropped Teresa off at her conference, I drove around Harbor Island at San Diego, California. San Diego normally has 266 days of sunshine. I was a little surprised and dismayed with the overcast weather. A cloudy overcast and gray day normally does not motivate me to shoot landscape or street photos. However, recently I viewed a YouTube video about that light is light and there is no such thing as bad light. I figured that though I was shooting my Canon A1 with color negatives, Kodak Pro Image 100, it will be easy to just turn the color photos into black and white with Lightroom Classic in order to emphasize all the shades of gray. Black and white photos are timeless and emphasize shapes and forms. According to the Port of San Diego website, Harbor Island Park grants visitors spectacular views of the city skyline, Coronado Bay Bridge, and all the activities happening on our dynamic waterfront. In addition to pristine views, Harbor Island Park features a shoreline path for walkers and joggers and a route for bikers. Amenities include picnic tables and restrooms. Dogs are allowed on leash in all Port of San Diego parks. There are no leash-free parks or beaches on Port of San Diego property. According to Wikipedia, Harbor Island is a man-made peninsula created in 1961 from harbor dredgings located in San Diego Bay, San Diego, California. It lies between Shelter Island and downtown San Diego and is directly across Harbor Drive from San Diego Airport. It is two miles long and only a few hundred feet wide. A single road, Harbor Island Drive, runs from one end of Harbor Island to the other and connects it to the mainland. The island includes several marinas which harbor thousands of small boats as well as several restaurants, two high-rises hotels, and Harbor Island Drive Park. It is under the control of the Port of San Diego, which owns all the land and provides municipal services such as police, road maintenance, etc.